Hello, Gold Class Monkeys. So today I have another food kind of story. It is Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. Here comes Pete. He's thinking, lunch? It is lunchtime. Pete is ready to eat. What should Pete eat? A sandwich would be nice. Yes, Pete wants a sandwich. Pete opens the fridge. You see anything good in there that would be good for a sandwich? He takes out a loaf of bread. He finds a yummy fish. Do you guys like fish? Would you eat a fish sandwich? He adds tomato and mayo. Those kind of rhyme. Pete looks at his sandwich. It is too small. Something is missing. Pete knows what it needs. His sandwich needs an apple. Pete loves apples. Is that how you guys make a sandwich? Do you just stick, put the whole loaf of bread there and a whole fish and a whole tomato and a whole apple and the jar of mayonnaise? That's not how I make a sandwich. His sandwich needs crackers. Crackers are crunchy. Pete loves crunchy crackers. Pete looks at his sandwich again. It is still too small. I don't think Pete knows how to make a sandwich. Pete is very hungry. Pete adds a pickle. Pete adds cheese. Pete adds an egg. Two hot dogs. Love hot dogs. A banana and a can of beans. Something is missing. Look at how Pete adds things to his sandwich. He didn't even peel the banana. Pete adds ice cream. He takes three huge scoops. Never had ice cream on a sandwich like that. Pete's sandwich is too big for Pete to eat. Pete wonders what to do. Pete thinks and thinks. I've got it, Pete says. Pete calls all of his friends. He calls the white cat with blue eyes and the black and white cat with yellow eyes and the cat with lots of hair on his head and the gray cat, blue eyes. He asks them to come over. He has one dog friend he called. Everyone goes to Pete's house. They are all very hungry. Pete shows them his big lunch. Are you hungry? asked Pete. Pete's sandwich is big enough for everyone. Dig in, says Pete. Pete's sandwich is good. Pete's sandwich is very good. Pete's sandwich is all gone. Pete's friends are full. They liked Pete's big lunch. Thanks for lunch, Pete's friends say. Thanks for sharing. You're welcome, Pete says. Sharing is cool. So that is Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. That story is actually in this book that I have, which has three different Pete the Cat stories in it, all in one book.
kind of cool when you get more than one story in a book. Some of you have brought those to school before. All right, that is Pete's Big Lunch. And I look forward to seeing all of you today, a little later, for lunch as well. Bye, friends. See you soon.